France, is a country primarily located in Western Europe, and is the most popular tourist destination in the world. The country is renowned, for its rich cultural heritage, vibrant history, fascinating food scene, and a whole lot more. France is home to one of the most visited cities in the world, or a magical city, Paris. Here's a look at the most famous landmarks, and best places to visit in France, but there are many more. The Eiffel Tower, is the most popular monument in all of France, and it is one of the most recognizable monuments in the world, as well as most symbolic structures in Europe. The Eiffel Tower was built to be, one of the main attractions at the Paris World's Fair, in 1889, and it became the tallest tower in the world at the time. The wrought iron tower is 324 meters tall, and composed of three levels, with many attractions within. Also it is offering unparalleled views over the city, from its viewing platforms. The Eiffel Tower was built and named after its designer, Gustave Eiffel. It is attracting over 7 million people annually from different parts of the world, and despite long queues, the Eiffel Tower is well worth a visit. The Mont Saint-Michel and its bay, count among France's most stunning sights. Set in a mesmerizing bay shared by Normandy, France, and Brittany, Mont Saint-Michel is the definition of dreamy, with over 1,000 years of history. This amazing monument is perched on a rock, and depending on the tidal conditions, surrounded by the Atlantic waters. At high tide, the tidal island is surrounded by the cold, fast-moving waters of the North Atlantic. At low tide, the land mass rises from the beach. For centuries, it was one of Europe's major pilgrimage destinations. At one point, during the French Revolution, this prestigious center of pilgrimage has been a prison, and today is a national monument, as well as this holy island is now a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The Mont Saint-Michel is the second most visited place in France, and it welcomes approximately 2.5 million people a year. The Louvre Museum in Paris, is the most visited museum in the world, and one of the most famous cultural landmarks in France. The museum dates back to the 12th century, when it was built as a fortress, but was transformed into a royal palace centuries later. After the French Revolution, it was officially converted from a palace, into a public museum since 1793. The large glass pyramid that marked the entrance to the museum, was completed in 1988, and beneath this striking piece of modern architecture lies, a world-class collection of some of the finest artworks in history. The Louvre Museum houses, one of the most impressive art collections in history, from French sculptures to Islamic arts, and Egyptian antiquities to the most iconic paintings, such as the Mona Lisa. Verdun Gorge, is a river canyon, in Provence southeastern France, and it is a striking place of natural beauty. Verdun Gorge is also called Europe's Grand Canyon, is one of Europe's most beautiful river canyons, and the best hidden attraction of Provence. Its name is derived, from the striking turquoise color of the Verdun River, that flows along its picturesque 25 km length. Reaching a depth of 700 meters at numerous points the Verdun Gorge is a popular destination for hiking, rock climbing, kayaking, rafting, mountain biking and more. Even you can hire a canoe or pedalo, or swim in crystal clear waters, that reach 27 degrees in summer. The Palace of Versailles, is an imposing royal palace, and it is one of the most important landmarks in French history. Palace of Versailles was built in the early 1600s, and was the principal residence of the French kings, from the time of Louis XIV to Louis XVI. With its gilded décor, lavish marble monuments, expansive pleasure gardens, and the most famous room the Hall of 357 Mirrors, this is one of the most famous buildings of France. One of France's most visited and stunning monuments, the Palace of Versailles, is now a historical monument, and UNESCO World Heritage Site. The Arc de Triomphe, is one of the most important structures in the city of Paris, and it is a symbolic landmark for the French people. At the center of the Star Square in Paris, where 12 grand lanes meet, 
you will find the Arc de Triomphe. Erected in 1836, the monument stands as a way to honor those French soldiers, who fought and died in the Napoleonic Wars, and French Revolution. The names of 660 French generals, are listed on the inside of the walls, as do a list of battles during the Napoleonic Wars. At the base of the arch, is the tomb of the unknown soldier from World War I, which boasts an eternal flame. In 1919, fighter pilot Charles Godefroy, flew his biplane right through the Arc de Triomphe, to mark the end of World War I, and honor those who fought in war. Today visitors can climb the 284 stairs to the top, and enjoy a breathtaking view over Paris, or admire the magnificent monument from the base. Mont Blanc or White Mountain, is one of the most famous European natural landmarks. Though it's considered to be one of the toughest mountains to climb, it's the heart of the European mountaineering community. Located in the Alps, the Mont Blanc Massif lies along the French-Italian border, and reaches into Switzerland. Rising 4,808 meters high, the Mont Blanc is the highest mountain in the Alps, and Western Europe. It is the second highest, and second most prominent mountain in Europe, after Mount Elbrus. The Mont Blanc is a must-see spot, for those who love the outdoors, as well as unbelievable scenery. Hiking all the way to the top, which is always covered in snow, is reserved for experienced hikers. A cable car can take you up to the top of Mont Blanc throughout the year, and also there are different excursions, that allow to admire the mountain vistas, as well as the intriguing glaciers, alpine lakes and ice falls from several breathtaking viewpoints.